M-A-R-K-H-U-B-B-A-R-D. It's kind of an eventful couple days here at Food City, hasn't Absolutely. it? Absolutely. It's been uh, something that I've never experienced, but there's always something going on, and it's been pretty sweet to have this, what just happened, go on. So. Well, when you go through manager's training, they probably don't brief you no, on that. No, they do baby, not. Do I mean, they, they say it's not always going to be positive, but, you know, you have to be ready for something that you, but I don't think I've ever had anything like this come my way. So. How did you hear about what happened? Well, I came in the next morning, and I always, at 6.30, 20 to 7, I grab a Kingsport Times paper, and that's no lie. I, and I always see what's going on in Kingsport. And when I saw that on the front page, I just, I, it was unbelievable. It was God's blessing. And, you know, you just don't normally see something like that on the front of the page. And also adding to that, being in the Food City parking lot here at Eastman Road. So it was uh it was different, I would say. So. And from there, how did all this get started? Well, we, you know, once something happens, you know, the way Food City is, you know, we build these big buildings, and, you know, big buildings are big buildings. But we want to be part of something, part of the community, the connection that we have. And when this happened here, it was just, I mean, we, we were running fast to see all that what we could do. Got a little bit of help from corporate, and uh, my team here put it all together, and, and we've got something that's, pretty wild here, you know, displayed here to give to them as a gesture, as a good faith gesture, and, and something, the stressful part that they're going through, it might help them a little bit through it, so, so it was it was a pretty good thing. So. Was the team here at Food City, did they get behind you as soon as they found a out what absolutely. you were doing? Absolutely. I mean, most of them has kids, but when something happens here, they like to work together. That's, that's what this community, that's what, you know, teamwork does, and and we call it actually, but they call it a lot about Team Hubbard here. So it, it was really good, and they actually did most of this work. So. And you've actually healed baby Isaiah now. I did, and it was, uh, I call it God's miracle. You know, they, they even said, and they're wearing a shirt today, that uh, that they named it Isaiah, and they named it after the, the book of Isaiah, uh, chapter 41. And, and, you know, fear not, I'm with you. And that's, that's special that, that, that they go that far naming a baby because they knew God was with them the whole time they were in our parking lot. So it's pretty special. You know, this family and this baby in particular has a particular tie to this food city. Are you looking forward to seeing them over it the next is, few years? It is, and I think it's, it's, it's got a lifetime tie to food city, and maybe one day I'll hire one of them, you know, or, or connect with them or help them even more. So it, it will have an everlasting tie. So I do agree. And you're looking forward to seeing him grow up through I the years? I am, and I love kids, and I have kids at home, and, and, and I call it God's blessing all the way to always have kids because you can influence them from the time they're born all the way through. And, and, and I think that's what men and women are here that has kids are meant to be. So. Good. I talk right. too much, don't I?